Hey guys, I'm Dan and right now we are actually in a natural history museum in Switzerland, Basel. There are plenty of cool dinosaur stuff, so let's get right into it. Okay, the first one is actually like a head statue of a Tyrannosaurus Rex. I think this is like the best one ever. I've never seen such a beautiful one before. Yeah, it looks really fantastic, highly detailed. I mean, take a look at this, you know, magnificent head scope. It just looks so incredible. Okay guys, so I think this looks like an Allosaurus fossil. Not too sure what this is exactly, but the head definitely looks like an Allosaurus. Wow, it's pretty incredible. Okay, here we have a Deinonychus fossil right here. It's basically like, you know, bigger than a raptor. So this is like a life-size fossil. Incredible. Okay, right here we have a Bindawaran. Not too sure what this is. It's probably like a reptile. And this is probably like a prehistoric man. Okay, and this is like the revolution or the evolution of the Iguanodon from 19 from 1833 to 2004. So you can see different depictions of the Iguanodon right here. Wow, incredible. Wow guys, this is the Cordipteryx. I think many of you guys should know. You know, we have actually reviewed plenty of um, Cordipteryx figures. What is this? Archaeopteryx. Wow, this is a nice sculpture of an Archaeopteryx. And what is this? Confucius on this. You, you guys should know that, you know, PNSO actually created one of these figures. So all these are basically the prehistoric birds. Okay guys, next we have a Cladiosaurus life-size, you know, statue. It looks incredible guys. Check this out. Wow. It looks amazing. This is basically the face of the Cladiosaurus. Incredible looking. What do we have right here? Some flora and fauna fossils. All these are like the actual, you know, prehistoric rocks and some fossils of, like, seems to be a dragonfly. And this is like a little rodent, I guess, not too sure. Wow, guys, check this out. This is an incredible, you know, painting of, um, I think there are like Allosaurus, some Brachiosaurus behind walking beside some huge brachiosaurus. There's a baby one right over here. Pretty incredible. Wow, check this out guys. This is a giant woolly mammoth. Wow, it's really big. I think this should be the um, actual size, the life size one. You can see it's like super furry. Yep, super furry. And you can see this is just an incredible sculpt. Yep, awesome. You can also find the skull, the skull behind. Well, next we have a Gomphotherium. It looks like a Dinotherium to me. Yeah, another prehistoric elephant. Huge one. Wow, check this out, guys. Dinotherium right here. This is a Paleomastodon. And um, yeah, we have Mammothers, Stegodon. So all these figures, I think they are really, really well done. This one looks like Dinotherium to me. I think it is a Dinotherium. Very well done. Wow, next one is actually the smaller Dawn. Oh my goodness, this... What do you call this? A statue? It, it, it looks just so real. Wow, it's incredible. It looks like an actual real smaller Dawn. Really, really well done. Wow, here we have a skeleton. I think this is like a replica of a Megalosaurus, which looks like a modern day deer with a huge antlers. This is an incredible animal. Okay, this animal right here, I think it seems to be a Barbirusa. Not too sure whether this is a prehistoric animal, but it seems to be a Barbirusa. Okay guys, I think this is a Moropus, if I'm not wrong, okay. They have the names written in, um, you know, either French or German, so I can't really tell. But, you know, from this statue, I think this is a Moropus. I think so. Awesome stuff. Okay, here we have some prehistoric animals, some prehistoric horse, I think. 
Okay, here we have the evolution of the um, prehistoric man, which is known as the Homo Nidatolensis. You can see the evolution. Slowly evolving to more human-like. Okay, next we have a massive giraffe right here. And it's actually known as a Messiah Giraffe. Hmm. Is this like a prehistoric giraffe? Not too sure, but it definitely looks huge. Okay, I think this is like a very huge statue of a... It looks like a rhinoceros, probably like a, you know, prehistoric rhinoceros and a goat right here. Um, this one, it seems like, you know, an you know, Onyftosuchus. This is probably one of the um, seals. Okay. Oh, this is a quagga, which is already extinct. And I think this is like a clouded leopard. This one looks like a glyphodon. Not too sure. Probably. Very nice. Wow. I think this one is like a Komodo dragon. Nice. Okay. This is an okapi. Which is known as the um, unicorn of Africa. Wow, this is a huge and massive walrus. Really huge one right here. A sloth. And uh, we have a panda. Nice one. Okay, guys, I think this looks like a fossil of a mosasaur. I think so. Not too sure what's the exact species, but it looks like a mosasaur. Pretty huge. Oh, is, is this a whale? Hmm. Not too sure. Probably a whale. Oh, guys, look at this. This is a marine iguana. I think it's um, still a species which still exists. And um, you have a platypus right here. Not too sure what this is. Looks like a sparrow. Okay, here we have a giant walrus and the okapi. This is a chimpanzee. Okay, this is, I think this is a coelocanth, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, that's right, a coelocanth, prehistoric fish. Um, this is a rhinoceros, java rhino. Let's see what else we've got. What is this? Hmm, it's a swan. And um, a blue whale. This is maybe a part of the blue whale. Okay, we have a beautiful rock right here. Two small little elephant. Dwarf elephant. Okay, nice. Because you can see the tusk are actually pretty long for a small elephant. And this is like the baby elephant. Okay, I think this is like a fossil or it could be like a replica of a T-Rex skull. It's a pretty nice one, I would say. Okay guys, so we are done with the museum tour. Hopefully you guys love the vlog. This is basically the Natural History Museum in um, Bern, Switzerland. Natural History Museum.